It's the knockout stages at the 2019 Total BWF Para Badminton World Championships. We're enjoying a day packed full of top class action and no shortage of drama. Coming up, the best of this afternoon's standing action in Basel, Switzerland. We begin with a men's singles SL3 match between second seed Daniel Bethel from England and Simon Cruz Mondeyar of Spain. With Danny Bethel, the left-hander, cerebral palsy sufferer and one of the world's very best half-court singles SL3 para badminton players. Former world number one Daniel Bethel looked perfect from the start and seemed to have the measure of his Spanish opponent. Brilliant from Bethel. Superb control of the shuttle from Dan. Cruz was unwilling to roll over, taking the fight right to the end of the game. 17 game points to Dan Bethel. Oh, Cruz with a winner. That's what we like to see. More of that. 4 20. Cruz survives. Clean point in the first. But it wasn't going to be enough to prevent the inevitable. Shame for Cruz. He built the rally well. It was good. The Englishman came out of the blocks, all guns blazing in the second. Dan Bethel, the number two seed, of course, right at the bottom of the draw. So typically the last to play. Great net shot from Cruz. Good pick up under this pr pressure, but Bethel too clever. The Spaniard struggled to find the perfect length to give himself a fighting chance. 23 and match point. And Bethel eased through into the quarterfinals and sets up a mouth-watering clash with Japan's Daisuke Fujihara. Good from Simon staying in the rally. But Bethel finishes it off with a fine net shot. <laughs> The handshake while Simon's lying on the floor. It's a World Championships last 16, so the most important thing is to win, to get through it, to get to the next stage. But yeah, it's always every match. I just get a bit more confidence in the hall. We don't obviously uh, practice or have much time in the uh, main arena, so to get the uh, match practice under my belt is really, really useful for the rest of the tournament. Another player who could go all the way here in Basel this week is men's singles SL4 number one seed Lucas Mazur of France, who is facing Yan Xuan of Chinese Taipei. Oh, a miss hit from Lucas. The world champion took the attack to his opponents from the very start. Brilliant straight smash. Five, the lift was three. short. Accurate from Mazur. The man from Taipei was digging deep to stay with Mazur. Oh. Yeah, well played it's from Yeah and Chuan. But could not do enough to prevent the first game slipping away. Game. First game won by and the end of the first game. Lucas turn of serve good. And the miss hit from Yeah and Chuan. The world champion, the world number one, takes the opener 21-18. The Frenchman never looked threatened in game two. His play was almost perfect at times. Yeah, and Chuan doing everything right except the final kill. He's unable to keep that one in court. Yeah, and Chuan couldn't find a way through the French defence, and the world number one closed out the match comfortably in the end. Match point, Mazur. Can. Yeah, and Chuan get it back. No, he can't. The next shot too tight. And the Frenchman moves on to the quarterfinals. First game, I didn't feel my best badminton, but in the second game, I was very happy of how I play, and my skills were clearly better in the second game, especially in the first game. I did a small mistake, but my opponent also played very good, so I feel very happy to be in quarter final. Tomorrow, we'll have the best of the action from day five in the standing hall at the 2019 Total BWF Para Badminton World Championships. <laughs>